Did you know that starting your drone up without unfolding the props does this to your drone? Hi, I'm Ashton Droning On, and if you love this kind of content, then smash that subscribe button below, because the more followers I have, the more content I can create for you. In addition, we're now offering a brilliant channel membership scheme. Just click the join button below to see what perks you can get. But anyway, a number of drone operators launch their drones without unfolding the props, and I cringe every single time I see it. Those of us that have been flying for many years will not start our drones without, first of all, unfolding the props properly. And that's because it can cause stress and strain on the motors, the arms, and other components of these drones. And despite what you might think, these are fragile aircraft, and you really don't want to be stressing those components, especially when it's gonna be up in the air and could fail if any of those components fail. With the props folded, it might look like a matter of milliseconds for them to unfold, but our slow motion footage may surprise you. Interesting to watch, wasn't it? And I bet the blades took far longer than you probably expected before they actually unfolded. You may have also noticed the rather aggressive way in which the drone starts when you start it with the props folded. So let's talk about those elements right now. During the startup, you might have noticed that the blades flop around and crisscross over each other. That's not healthy at all for those props, especially if you have a slightly bent or damaged blade, that could cause damage to the other blade and the overall prop ends up being throwaway. In addition, the blades flopping around like that puts additional stress on the motors. These tiny little motors are not designed to have all of the weight swinging around like that. They're designed to have the weight distributed and balanced in an even way. And so for that tiny little motor to be taking that entire weight until the props separate is putting undue stress on the motor and that's not good for these little things. I'm sure that many of you remember the arm stress failures on the old Phantom 3 where the motor mounts where the brushless motors are actually attached to the arm started to crack. What we certainly don't want to see is that kind of issue occurring on the Mavic and with the motor swinging that kind of weight on one side certainly does put stress on the little mounting points of these tiny brushless motors. The significant amount of wobble is in the arms during startup as well. All of the arms stress and fluctuate during that startup, and that's not good for those arms or the joints which are in here. Within these arms here is a tiny little component called an axis, and that's a little spring-loaded device that gives you this springiness. During the rather aggressive startup, you can see the arms bouncing back and forth, and that's putting undue movement and stress on those arm joints. Looking long-term, it could lead to early replacement needed of the axis and also so loosening of the arms entirely. Next is that all important delicate little gimbal. This is probably one of the most expensive components of your drone besides the battery as well. And you can notice during the rather aggressive startup, the amount of movement in that gimbal. Now gimbals are of course designed to cater for quite a bit of movement during flight, but that's gentle movement whilst the drone is in flight. It's not the kind of aggressive and violent shaking that you see during the startup in the slow motion videos. Starting up your drone in this way repeatedly over years could lead to early failure of the the gimbal mounts which are quite delicate and tucked away up there. So they're the key issues that I'd be worried about. Now I'm not an engineer but I don't like the stress or the aggressiveness of the startup with the folded props and so I certainly wouldn't put my drone through that and hopefully you won't put yours through it either. Just as a comparison I did the same tests with the blades unfolded and as you can see in this side-by-side -side comparison the startup is much less aggressive
Neither the arms, the blades, or the gimbal is put through anywhere near as much stress during this kind of startup, and that's how we really, really want to see you guys starting up your drones in future. So before you start your drone, it's so simple to unfold the props. Here's our tip. Simply set the drone down, unfold all of the arms, and then hold the tips of the two blades, separate them out, and then pull very, very gently outwards. What that does is not only pull the blades so that they're outwardly aligned, but you'll notice that it also centralizes the center hub of the blade of the props. And that means that the blades are nicely balanced before the motor starts spinning. Doing it this way means that your props will hopefully prompt less of an aggressive startup. So hopefully this has been useful. Please comment below with your thoughts give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you're a bit of a bent prop and click that subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching.